being able to see is something many people take for granted. Tonight, our Josh Peterson shows us how new technology has made it possible for two sisters at Bemidji High School to see for the first time. These two Bemidji High School freshmen are not playing the latest video game. They're actually using the latest technology to be able to see. Twin sisters Alina and Anna are legally blind. However, by using these new headsets, they're able to see like everyone else. For their mother, the technology has been a huge blessing for the family. We're looking forward to um, using the headset they have now out in the community. I mean, you know, to see things that we go to that they don't see. Over the past couple of years, their family has been busy fundraising to help the girls experience everyday life. Through the use of Onyx, the device can enlarge crystal clear images from far away or simply read a book. And Dante chomped it down. Technology alone over the past few years has played a major role in the girls' lives. Two years ago, we went and tried, actually tried a headset, two years ago. Okay. And when we were driving home, Alina asked, um, how long do you think it would be before we could actually get something like that? Because it was amazing. For Alina, the use of irisware has made it possible for her to live life in the moment for the first time. I will get somewhat to learn like the other kids and see what experience what they're experiencing at the same time rather than having someone explain what's going on you know what is the teacher writing on the board Anna was overcome with joy with how happy the new headset makes her feel I felt wow a first is how virtual people can see but I want to use this for mom, it's an opportunity to see her daughters experience life and see the world in focus. As a mom, it's just exciting to know that they're going to get the opportunities like, like we get. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. The Iris Vision headsets cost $2,500. If you see the girls wearing the headsets out in public, the family encourages everyone to say hi. Please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.